first day of uni, and the first question is, what the fuck do I wear? So I put this on, because I was like, you know what? I have more important things to worry about than what I'm wearing. Like, it's just uni, you know? Oh my god, it's gonna be an hour and it's gonna be so boring. But at least it's only an hour, so I can just play Tetris for an hour and go home. Happy as day. It's not like I'm doing medicine or anything, I'm not saving the world. I'm just figuring out how to get more money when I'm older. I'm always so scared that I smell. That I'm like gonna show up and I'm gonna just be so stinky. And it doesn't help that it's so warm that the moment you start walking, you're gonna start sweating balls. And when you start sweating balls, you're gonna start stinking. You're like, oh. Now for the grand reveal. Oh. Currently, this is my better option. It certainly looks like I'm a, I'm a man in business. I got distracted and I need to be leaving the house in less than like five minutes. Anyone who dislikes my stickers can like literally just stop. You're not my friend. Do I need the case? Maybe, but will I? No. My iPad. Ta-da! So this is really heavy and I feel like my toad is gonna just snap off. So I really hope that that doesn't happen. Oh shit, I didn't have breakfast. Oh, why do I? Oh, I actually had a cookie. You know what? That's enough for me. I think I forgot to lock the door. Oh well. Just don't break in or I'll be... Oh my god, my hair does not look that good. I stink. Also, I have a headache because I haven't drunk enough water. So, um... <laughs> I this going great. How about yours? It smells like doo-doo here. Catching the bus home. Had to end up sharing it with a bunch of high schoolers. Because basically I tapped my go card after topping it up, but it hadn't topped up yet because my purchase was still pending because I was in the negatives. So I had to go, get a ticket, wait more, get on the bus finally, then share it with fucking high school students. The tutorial though was so much fun. Sat there, did my thing. My stomach was goggly, it was like, you know how a gargly stomach sounds like. So I'm just here awkwardly like hoping that no one can hear my stomach growling. So if you were sitting around me and you heard someone's stomach gargling, it was not me. Not me. We live, we love, we made some friends along the way. So it's all that matters. I took some notes. So yeah, that was, it was a success. So I'm fucked because my go card still has no money on it. Even though I literally topped it up yesterday, got paid, and now I know that I was in the negatives before I got paid, but when I got paid, my bank account went up to the positive. The 10 was taken into account. So it's like, excuse me, what? So how am I getting to uni, I hear you ask? I don't know. Worst case scenario, I'll call an Uber. But also, it's so awkward because like, yesterday I knew someone at my tutorial. I mean lecture, I knew someone like that. So it was like, fine. Today, I'm going in blind. I'm like, these are all new people. And this is literally like grade seven again, except I'm socially awkward now. I used to be like, hi, I'm Thomas. What's your name? Wow, that's so good. Nice to meet you. And now I'm like, but I was scrolling on TikTok my TikTok feed was giving me a lot of that vibes and I was like, okay, like I'm not the only one, thank God. I'm getting the Uber. This is so embarrassing, but a oh, man's gotta do what he's gotta do, am I right? Today was eventful. I feel like I'm honestly more excited now about the business degree, which is not what I expected to be going. My thought process this entire time has been my business degree is like my work and my creative writing degree is like my fun pastime hobby thing to keep me sane but I'm looking through this first assignment and I'm like fucking why? <laughs> I have to read like three books. Um it's due on the April 5th so I can just it's only 800 words so I can 
to write 800 words in like two hours, so that's an April problem. <laughs> So yesterday was fun, got the Uber, and then the entire day with imposter syndrome because these lecturers are talking to us about how we're devoted to our discipline of art that we chose, and I chose creative writing. And I was like, mm -hmm. they were like, you know, this is your dream. You're here because to you, writing is not a hobby, it's work. And I could tell that everyone around me like felt like to them, writing was something they were devoted to. Like they, these are people that I'm like, yeah, you obviously dream of being an author, being a poet, being some sort of writer. And I'm like, I'm just here to have some fun. <laughs> like, I don't think I consider writing as work right now. <laughs> And I don't know if I will consider it as work. Like, my dream is not to be an author. And everyone was typing so fiercely around me, whether they were writing notes or what. And I'm here like playing Pac-Man. My go-kart though fixed itself. Now it has like $20 on it. It's like I took that one Uber and the universe was like, you've done your work, babe. You've paid your punishment for your crime. Might have a negative balance in my bank, but in my spirit, I'm positive. I did, I did find a friend though. One of the people that I met in the um, orientation, I ran into them and I was like, oh my God, we both got the same lectures, like beautiful. So that was not a worry anymore. The tutorials though, I'm so scared about because it's gonna be like a small classroom. It's like, where do I sit? Who do I sit with? I don't know. I'm already looking at some of the stuff for like next week. And one of the lectures, it's like, watch these two videos and read these three readings before. And I'm like, phone a friend. <laughs> Today's my last lecture of the week. And I, nervous because turns out I did recognize a few people for my Wednesday lectures so that was fine and I'm just hoping that the same thing happens for this lecture because I'm literally like how the fuck do I start a conversation with someone I've never met before hi how's it going I think my best conversation starter for talking to strangers is usually I compliment part of what they're wearing I'm like, hey, oh my God, I love your pants. I love your shirt. Like if I'm in a position where I don't know what to talk about, I will go, I love your outfit. Like, where did you get it from? The look. The tote bag is so fucking heavy. Before this year, I was considering getting a gym membership, but honestly, I might as well not. Like these tote bags are so fucking heavy. And if I'm carrying them like four times a week, for like half to full of the day. I won't need a gym membership. I'm gonna have broad as fuck shoulders by the end of the year anyway, for free. So that lecture happened. That was not fun. Basically ran to my lecture because I didn't want to be late. Cause like one, that's embarrassing. And two, on like, Tuesday, my first lecture, there were people sitting on the stairs, not in a seat or anything. Like there just wasn't space. So they were on the stairs and I was like, I don't want that to be me. So I was like zooming, finally got there, literally three minutes to spare, but I didn't know anyone. So, you know, I had to awkwardly find a seat, got to it, be like, hey, is anyone sitting there? Turns out, okay, you know, turns out I'm actually really good at making friends. I was like, yes. How are you? Like, yes, love, I'm Tom, what's your name? And I was just talking, yapping. I was like, wow, so proud of myself. And plus the lecturer gave us like five minutes to talk. It was like, icebreaker, talk to each other. And I was like, ugh, again? It's three in the afternoon, I wanna go to sleep. And I did because that lecture was so fucking boring. 
But Mr. Professor literally spent the entire lecture talking about shit that either was on our orientation or just should have been on our orientation. There was an entire slide about how we should spend 10 hours studying per unit. And I was like, I mean, I'm probably well closer to assignment, but right now I'm not spending 10 hours. And only the last five minutes of a 65 minute lecture was actual content. And by that point I wasn't listening, so. I don't actually know what I learned. Long story short, this week was not as bad as I thought it would be. It ended up being chill. I had so much fun learning. So I was going meant to go out tonight. Like I bought tickets to this party like for a week at like clubs. And but like I don't have the money because well, I don't have the money. And I also don't really have the shit to get one. I just wanna snuggle up into bed, watch Netflix, wake up in the morning and go, well, oh, shouldn't have stayed up all night watching Netflix. Well, that's the vlog, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I enjoyed my own first week of uni. It was so much fun. I'm so glad to be back learning. I will see you guys in the next one and have a slay day, have an amazing week and hopefully my next video is super fun as well.